Hello my friends. So I am sitting in front of Five Below. I want to go in there, see what kind of organizing things that they have and possibly see what kind of um, stocking stuffers maybe I can get for the girls. Um, this is going to be a great Five Below haul and shop with me. But first, if this is your first time watching me, hello, welcome to my channel. My name is Gia and girl, I love a good shop with me. So grab yourself a cup of coffee. So let's go on the Five Below together. I would love for you to join my YouTube family by clicking the subscribe button down below as well the little bell next to it and for those already subscribed welcome back all right let's get into five below and see what they got look at this frozen two game it's called marble frenzy so what do you do with it you just let's see let me read this real quick are you racing marbles hmm a piece of me wants to get this as another game for the girls because obviously it's only five dollars if everything in five below is under five but it would be a pain in the butt to try to put this together every time. You see what I'm saying? I don't know. I'm going to put it in my cart and think about it. If you've never heard of Five Below or been to a Five Below store, and, um, if you don't have them near you, basically everything in the store is under $5. And they have some like cool things in here. Like I got the girls' headphones for their school in here, $5. I mean, they don't last very long, but it's like long enough for the school year. Um, lots of little tech things and... I don't know, you'll see in the store, they have a lot of cute things. It's, for, to me, it's worth it under five bucks. They have the um, the gummy bears uh, frozen kit. The only thing with this is I like the pre-built ones, girl, because it's hard to get it standing up. But the pre-built ones are like 20 bucks. They're so expensive. Oh, they have a frozen one too. It's a cookie kit. These are all $5. This is the kind of tech stuff they have, like stuff for your car. I really need this for my phone. They have the little Bluetooth headphones. $5.55. I thought everything was under $5, but these are $5.55. Okay. And little portable speakers. Like, this is cute little cheap gifts, you know? This is a cute game. I'm going to get the girls sloth in my broth. Like, little silly games like that. They like that kind of stuff. Again, $5. Can't beat it, girl. It's better than spending $15 at Target. Look, they have the Oreo cotton, um, candy canes. Uh, my editor just said that she tried these and they tasted like Tootsie Rolls and she hated them. So that's just what I heard. Um, I'm not a fan of, I don't know, I just, if I'm going to eat an Oreo girl, it's going to be a cookie, not a candy cane. Um, but I did get the girls some um, Jolly Rancher ones um, that I heard are really good. And look, they have Smarties. These are all $3, but I think they're cheaper at um, Walmart because they were $2.42 there. They have a whole Frozen 2 section here which is cute. Let me go down here because I know my girls are into it. They love the Frozen. Zara actually said she wanted a Frozen, little Frozen figurines from Frozen too. I'm hoping they have those here because at Target Girl, they were $40 for the little figurines. I'm like, uh-uh, can't do it. Here's all the headphones, $5.55. Siri, you can't beat it. You know, they're cheap enough so that when they break, you can just replace them. This is cute, a light board. I think Zara would really, really like this. I used to have one as a kid. It's like a little mini one. They have lots of, um, you know, Bluetooths and um, car chargers and stuff like that. Oh, look at this headset mount. That's cute. This is a good deal, like I said. These are all five bucks. Um, I need, actually, I need a new Bluetooth because one of my, um, one side only works. But I just haven't bought one yet. But, um... Yeah, I don't know how well these work because I've never used them, but the girls have used these uh, headphones. This little vacuum keyboard, that's cute, right? Reading lamp. I love all this stuff, it's so cute. Tablet clamp stand, these little ring lights. I use this actually um, on my phone and even when I'm filming sometimes on my camera. That's cool. I wish they had tripods here because that would be wonderful. See what's this? Oh, this is nice. Foldable phone stand. Well, that would be nice when I'm trying to live stream on Instagram. Which, by the way, if you're not following me on Instagram, girl, what are you doing? Follow me, because I like try to live stream every week. Let me see. Look at these um, I watch Apple Watch um, protective lenses. I didn't know they sold these. Huh? That's cool. Oh, wow, they have like crafting sets. This is the same stuff they sell at Target. You know, TJ Maxx, Marshalls, but all of these are just $5. I'm gonna look to see if there's anything that the girls would like. Oh, look at this, it's a JoJo Siwa game. 
on tour with Jojo. That's cute. So they have like colored pencils and markers. Sorry, the music is so loud. And um, adult coloring books here. It's nice. Look at these. Magic mathematics. That's really cute. I have something similar that I bought from Costco. Like, but it's a small, it was a much bigger box with more things. But for only $5 for this, that's a good deal. And then spelling. Cute. I was hoping they'd have some Polly Pockets. They used to have Polly Pockets here. Uh, at least at another um, Five Below that I've been to. But I don't see them here, unfortunately. But the games are amazing. And I'm going to get several. Because my girls do want games. And it's so much cheaper than buying, like, a $20 game from like Target or Walmart. Now the classics like Monopoly and stuff like that, Operation, sure, but these little silly games, it's so much cheaper to get here. Look at this little Black Panther powerful levitating hero. They have Superman, they have, what else? Um, dinosaurs, that's really cute. Ryan's world is everywhere. Wow, they have Pikmin Pops here, 3 dollars I hate Pikmin Pops, I just think they're so stupid. Let me see what else they have. They have a good, great books here as well too for kids like these readers <clears throat> these leveled readers um ava likes these and then even zara will read um level four too so i like that i have these here they have these like similar to pop socket one time i bought an off name brand um pop socket and i forget what it was called but it was absolutely horrible i hated it so i will only stick to the pop socket brand from now on let me know if any of you guys have tried any of these though and if they work of course they have phone cases here too really cute ones this is cute something different oh this one's really pretty i like it is it protective though uh let's see i think these are so cool like the neon lights in the toilet Oh, my girls would get a kick out of that, but I'm not gonna spend five bucks on it. And this is nice too, the LED light strips. The different colored lights behind the TVs or you can put it underneath cabinets, it's cool. This case where you can pull it down and it's like a loop or it can be a stand. Now that is cool, very cool. They have lots of candy here. This is a good stocking stuffer, but I just, girl, I could do without the candy though, girl. Birthday party supplies. Look at this, how cute is that? Like a little end table. These are the only kind of organizers they have here. Now I've been to other Five Below's where they have like the clear ones. But it's all good. Um, yeah. These are cute for a dollar. These are really nice quality. These are one dollar. And very thick. Um, I guess for like an office or something. They have cute little makeup bags and stuff here. Very cute. Yep. Oh my gosh, look at that snack sedent. That is so cute. They have all types of little beauty blenders and makeup brushes and eyelash rollers. Oops. <clears throat> all that kind of cute stuff. Oh, oh boy, tearing it up. Um, caught it though. Let's see, there we go. Then let's see what these are. Unique cloths, quickly and easily remove makeup. I saw something similar to this on um, Instagram. I wonder if it really works. Oh, look at all this for five dollars each. Especially these, these are nice. Cuticle pusher, all of that kind of stuff. I'm gonna pamper yourself. Oh, a brush cleaner, that's cute. Three dollars. Of course they have um, press on nails and stuff. It's all the rage, press on nails. Um, I like the nail polish stickers though. I've been into that lately. All right, time for me to edit. All right, y'all, so I'm back home. Let me quickly show you what I got. I'm gonna start with the things that I got for myself. Now, these were $5.55 each. And I hope they work, because girl, if they don't, I will be taking them back. This is for my car, and as soon as I'm done filming, I'm gonna go out there and test it, and I will insert the clip here if it works or not. The same with this foldable phone stand, because it's like a tripod, and I need it, because when I go live, I want it to be up high because the little stand that i have it just sits on my desk so these are my two things again these were 5.55 each everything else was five dollars so look at here it works let me get my lighting on for you guys so you can see this works really well um well i mean well enough my car is old girl you know she's an elder she's 15 years old and well almost 15 at this point and so it's like a little bit heavy it makes the the vents 
point downwards, which is fine. I mean, I guess in the, su in the summertime it'll be kind of hot. And because my pop socket is on the back of it, I had to put it down low instead of in the center. But so far, so good. I mean, I'm happy with it. Sorry, I'm trying to see how I can do my lighting so it's not a reflection. But yeah, I, this is awesome. So that's definitely worth the $5. This is what it looks like when my phone is out of it. So yeah, my phone is heavy. I have an iPhone 7 Plus. And because the pop socket, like I said, is in the center, I have to put the bar down here. But yeah, this is great. So I got them these two um, Elsa heads because um, they like to pretend like they're doing hair when I do their hair. I just thought this was cute for $5, girl, because these are usually like 30 especially for the bigger heads. I bought Ava one last year for Christmas and they sometimes argue over it. So I bought them two Elsa heads. Now the rest are games. I got this two in one JoJo Siwa game. They're two games in one. So it's like a it's like a version of Candyland and then a version of, you know, you pull the cards and see who gets the matching JoJo Siwa. I don't know. It's something silly for us to play with because we do like to play games a lot together. I got this memory match game, a Toy Story version. Um, Ava's really good at this game. She always wins between the four of us. So <clears throat> we got this and I know they'll like that. This Kerplunk is really cute. I think I remember having something like this when I was a kid. It's like you have all the sticks in there and then pull it out. <clears throat> Everybody takes turns pulling it out until the marbles fall. I bought this light up board. Zara is really gonna love this. But these are gonna be both of their um, these are gonna be both of their gifts, so they, they will open it together. But I think that Zara will especially like this. Um, I got guess who? Um, zoo, which is cute. Um, I think that they'll like this because they do like to play the regular Guess Who. This pop and race game, it's like a, I think a version of Sorry, but for Pick Me Pops. So I think they'll like that. Stinky Safari, which is, <laughs> you have to like step on the poop. I don't know, it had poop in it and I know my girls will giggle and like that. And then headbands, a Disney version of headbands because my parents have a, a headbands game that the girls really, really like. So I got them this as well. So that is it. Let's see how many items I bought. One, two, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12 items, okay? 12 items I bought and altogether it was around $62. I think $62.17. So that's a steal to me. And like, I'm not buying any more games. This is it. These are the games that they're gonna get for this year. Again, they're just like silly cheap games and it's better than spending like $15 a piece. Now I may invest in Monopoly Junior to have with them because I want them to learn how to play Monopoly. I think Zara's old enough to, to start learning how to play. Ava's a little young. Um, but Monopoly Junior, I feel like we'll all be able to play. So if I do buy another game, it will just be that. Um, so yeah, um, I'm happy with that. So what I'll do is this is gonna go in our sinking funds. This um, will come out of our sinking funds, funds budget for Christmas, except for I will take uh, $12, deduct $12. So this will just be, you know, for me and not Christmas gifts. So I'm happy, girl. I'm trying to get ahead of the game when it comes to Christmas, girl. I'm not trying to be up all night, Christmas Eve wrapping and, you know, stressing out trying to get things on time. So that is it. Leave a comment down below and let me know. Do you shop at uh, Five Below? Um, and if you are almost done with your Christmas shopping, you know, or do you get your kids gifts if your kids are my age and stuff? What, what, Primarily, are you guys going to be getting them? Thank you guys so much for watching. If you haven't hit that subscribe button yet, you can tap my picture up above. And you can also check out my previous video right over here. And all of my social media platforms, all listed down below. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.